is Min Huai. Today I learned English. American takes a break. Social Study One, Lesson Two. Let's start. Here we have a class. It is a class. Class is a verb. It is a noun. It means a period of time. It is a period of time. Means small time to teach a group of students. So a class is like. When is your class? It is kind of like um time that is for you to learn one subject like art, language arts, or math, English, many other subjects, or maybe music. Right, a period of time to teach a group of students, maybe a whole classroom, or maybe. Just in groups, in small groups. Now, next we have the word classroom. So, classroom is where a class learns. So, class and room go together to make the word classroom. Classroom means a place in school used to teach a group of students, used to teach a big group of students, or maybe small group of students. It might be. Twenty people, or maybe twenty people, or maybe thirty or forty students in this classroom. There are so many kinds of classroom. And there's classroom for PE, for music time, for IT time, for art time, for English time, for math times. There are different kind of classroom, and they are in different group and in different classes. Different rates and in different subjects. How big is your classroom? Maybe your classroom will have twenty people or maybe thirty people, right? Maybe twenty people is the most popular kind, or maybe thirteen people. Right? Maybe there are many kinds of classroom that you can have. So this classroom, we have a big board with two small board for students to write in their essays, and one big blackboard for the teacher. They have um, windows and they have um, chairs. So next we have principal. Principal is the head teacher. Of of course, in a school you can have many teacher, so many teacher, not just one, only one teacher. But this is just the first and the last kind of principal. It is he or she is the head teacher of the school. So, in a school, and they sit in charge of. They charge up. And they make rules. They make different rules and different laws for the students, for their other teachers, so that the school of the principal will be good, right? It'll be good and right. So the principal is the head teacher of the school. So she or he will need to do a lot of important things, not just only teach students. But they need to do、um, like things like cleaning, like checking classroom, like cleaning classroom, like paying the pay for the people, for the teachers, for the workers, right? Maybe the principal is very important. They think about the students and they make sure the students won't do any bad thing again, so that they won't. They will be a good student. Not a bad student. And next we have rule. Rule. We've talked about rules before. But rules are like a kind of things and instruction about what people must do or must not do. This is kind of like a class rules first. This is kind of like a class rules. Listen when someone else is speaking is a rule too. Listen, not speaking when someone else is speaking. We're quietly at your desk. Maybe we're quietly not chatting with our friends. Or hey, 
Can I borrow your pencil? Can I borrow your chart? Maybe not like that. Work quietly. Or maybe treat others with respect. Like don't treat others with bad attention, with bad habits. So it will make all the class to be bad like you do. Raise your hand when you need help or you want to speak something. Because if you just said, "Hey, can I ask you something?" that would ruin the things that the people is talking. Play safely. Play safely. It's like you you can't run fast. Maybe if there's rain, you will be you can hurt if you don't. Follow this rule because now the ground was so so sticky and so 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 hard to walk on. It's very hard for people to walk. So how can you run? Yes, and make wise choices. Don't make bad choices, right? Now next we have responsibility. Responsibility is something that people should do. They should do it. With their own selves, they follow the rules. They follow the rules and the laws, right? So we、we'll、talk about the word follow next time. But now we、we'll、talk about responsibility. Responsibility. Sometimes people should do that thing by themselves. Now tell any other people to say that to remind them, right? Responsibility is things that people need to do by themselves, <coughs> right? Like this teddy bear, he's using his cart belt so that he won't be fallen when he was driving too fast or he's stopping in a very very short time. He won't be hurt with this belt cart. Okay, far, fair. So far, fair is a word that you need to know. So fair is a way that is right and it is honest to ask people. It's not like cheating. It is the opposite of the word cheating or unfair. It is in the right way, but it's right and honest for ask people. So, like if you're fair, you're telling the truth, and you're saying the truth for ask people. You're saying the right thing, and it's good. Fair is good, but what if you are unfair or you cheating? You take an example, and then you say that yesterday I'm sick at home and I can't do anything. But yesterday you're playing, so that's you're lying with other people and you're making them believe you. So that's the bad thing. So. And the next time when you are saying the truth, they won't think that you are talking about the truth in a right way, right? But they are thinking that you are lying again, and they will never believe you anymore, right? So you need to be fair with other people, and you have to be honest with them. You can't always take lies. Now let's see. We have the word follow. So follow means to obey. Follow can mean follow the rules. Follow someone else. Follow something. Follows your mom. Okay. Maybe if you follow your mom, you always want to stay with your mom, and you don't want to leave your mom. So this boy, he's teaching the dog how to sit, sit. So the dogs need to follow, to obey the things that, um, the boy is teaching, right? He needs to obey for that, so he can be a good dog. Okay. So that he won't be a bad dog. <laughs> okay. So now it's time to say bye. Bye.